popping candy. Oh, oh, that looks really popping. good. Look at that one, Stracatilia. I don't even know no, what to say. Yeah. Oh, look, coconut, coconut, coconut. Oh, hello. Yeah, oh. And uh, welcome to City Cottage Kids. The show that puts the fun back into food. This week, we'll be looking at all the foods that you just love to eat. And we have come to a very busy Fredericks to try something that's very cold. Comes in loads and loads of flavours. Uh, good in the summer. Oh, you eat it from a triangular shaped item that is also edible. <gasps> Got it. Polar yeah. bear in one. No, it no it it was um ice ice cream. It was ice cream. I don't know which one I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get the banana I'm gonna get one. one. I'm gonna have this orange chocolate chip one. Yeah, because if you get that, then I can taste that one too. Yeah, and I can have a lick of your banana as well. No, you're not licking it. You're not licking my no, ice cream. Look, That's disgusting. You're no, gross. Just a lick. It's not gross no, at all. No. Anthony starts work on your ice cream every morning at 7 a.m. 7 a.m.? Mm hmm. The first stage of making ice cream is called pasteurization. This is going to kill off any bacteria found in liquid foods. You'll start it by first adding the cream, mm. followed by. Full cream milk powder. Well read, Emma. In it goes. Hey, look, they're adding water. This is all going to get mixed together, mixy mix. That's great, but where's my ice cream? Patience, Emma. First, he's got to add the emulsifier. In it goes. This is going to help it stick together. Next up, the sugar. Mm -hmm. And then the vegetable oil, followed by just a little smidgen of butter. A smidge? How much do you put on your toast? Oh, a lot more than that. In it goes. Plop. Then he's going to add a little sprinkle of Madagascan vanilla powder. Mm. Once all of these are mixed together, he's then going to heat everything up to 80 degrees. But he must be careful that it doesn't go over 85. No, because that would cook the cream. And then it would not be ice cream. Next, it's going to be added to the holding tank, ready for the first stage of cooling. The mixture gets passed through a thing called a homogenizer. A what, what, what? This is where everything gets squished together so it sticks even more. After this, it's then going to get cooled down to around about 40 or 50 degrees. And then ice cream. No, then it's got to go through a water chiller where it goes down to 8 degrees. And then ice cream. No, then it's got to go through a second chiller where it goes to 4 degrees and finally ready for the flavour to be added. Yes! Hang on. Why is it blue? That's because today's flavour, Emma, is bubblegum. Oh, look, Emma, this one's green. What flavour do you reckon that's going to be? Uh, broccoli. Broccoli. No, you wally, it's mint and chocolate chip. But where are the chocolate chips? We'll add that later, don't oh. worry. Oh wow! Oh my gosh! These look amazing. Oh my gosh, these look amazing. So, how many flavors are there in total? Because there is a lot here in already. In total, we make up 250 flavors. Wow! I didn't even know there's 250 flavors in the whole universe, and never mind one ice cream shop. Um, we've brought some cones. Ready. Um, and um, and I was wondering if if I could try this banana chocolate one. Of course, yeah, go for it. <laughs> um, okay. Okay. Oh. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, hang on, wait, wait. Ah, oh my I'm gosh. trying to go for a... Oh my gosh, it's really hard yes. to do. Masterpiece. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. I think mine definitely one. looks more like a child <laughs> might have made it. Mine looks so professional. <laughs> yeah, Have okay. I had that? And then you Now that just makes it, look at that. Wowzers. Look at that. Mine looks really tropical. Blues and oranges. Mm, really good. Um, mm. Today's taste test. Good. Approved. Mm, that's very good. Mm. You got it on your face. Oh. <laughs> well, a little bit. Like that. Yeah, it's, it's sort of just that, yeah, you got it, you got it, you got it. You got it. <laughs> 